Shirley McLean greeted her husband at the door in this little number from What a Way to Go. A svelte pearl Bailey pranced around in this simple dress way back when. And 1920s star Mae Murray showed up for a blind date wearing this. Edith Head says the plot to life was simple back in those days. All men were rich and handsome, all women were beautiful, and the right dress nabbed the right man. Now, for example, in the, you know, the famous love story of Lombard and Gable, anyhow, she went to a party and everybody's supposed to be dressed in pink, you know, with the pink ball. She came in the window because the door was guarded in the white dress. He took one look at her, he fell madly in love with her, and they got married and lived happily ever afterward because she wore the right dress. And the same thing applies. Now, take, take Mae West uh, in this picture, which was called... Uh, uh, she done him wrong. Cary Grant was a heroine, paid no attention to her, so one day she came up in this dress, and she, you can't walk in that dress, you slither. <laughs> Anyhow, so she slithered past him, he took one look at her, he fell madly in love with her. I mean, it's a repetition, all of this, so I'm not going to repeat it. But all of, the, all of the different dresses are based on the fact that if you wear the right clothes, you will live happily ever after. So did Audrey Hepburn when she wore this dress in Sabrina. Just like that, Humphrey Bogart and William Holden, built to Miss Head, couldn't resist her either. But what about women today? Now, my theory is that most women are happily married. But if any of you aren't happily married, you make the right dress, and you'll get married and live happily ever afterwards. W will you sit down and give me a few lessons before I leave? Guaranteed. Lynn Harrison, Action News.